Okay. Uh, we're gonna begin our lesson today, and uh, we're gonna move to the the next topic, which is uh, to the airport. <coughs> So did you prepare your dialogue like I said, like I told you to? Hôm qua em với Phú vẫn chưa trình bày cái bài công việc anh ạ. À, okay. Cái hội thoại ạ. Okay, okay. You can talk about it now. Okay. <coughs> Please begin your dialogue or your talk about that uh, work topic, that topic or work. Okay, for turn on your mic. Like a pro, huh? Okay. English, please. Um, <coughs> you know, say I'm um, listening. You know what? What? What happened? Oh, for you are here. You know what? What? What happened? Uh, I met a um, traffic accident along the way to the company this morning. Just a minute. Wait, meet what? A traffic accident. Oh, okay. I had. I had. Okay. Uh, yeah, I just saw it on Facebook a few minutes ago. It's terrible and it make a pretty big traffic jam. Many vehicles can, cannot even go through it. Yeah, I was stuck in there for goddamn 50 minutes. It feel like an uh, eternity. Just a minute, you were saying you're stuck in there, what? Can you say that sentence again? For goddamn 50 minutes. Goddamn, goddamn. God damn. Okay. Um, but when I came here, boss was calling me, and he that was terrified. Say it again. The boss called me. The boss called me. Called me. Called. Because when you say boss. the boss was called, meaning you say somebody else called him, right? That is passive voice. Thầy bị động quá Bị vỡ thứ hai lúc em nói là thầy bị động quá Cần xin nhé Dạ Cần xin nhé Dạ 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 um, were you punished by him? Um, no, he just called me and he forgave me already. Oh, how, how did you go to it and came me so early? Say it again. Did Say that sentence again. How, how did you go through it and came me so early? Get in so early? Did you say that? Came here. Came here. Uh, don't eat the word. You pronounce it. Open your mouth widely. Okay. Continue. 
No, I didn't go home last night. I had to process a bunch of documents. Then I took a little rest in a staff bedroom. Oh, I'm, I'm going to continue my work right now. I have to submit it after lunch time. See you. Uh, yeah, get back to work. So, do you really actually have a staff bedroom in your workplace? Yeah, I think so. You don't have it because it's not your home. So, anyway, I am. Uh, could you say that traffic jam again? Um, traffic jam. J traffic jam. Traffic jam. Not jam. Did you check your? Did you check it? Pronunciation first. Did you check it? Pronunciation. Oh, it's j, j, jam. 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 Is this is jam? This is butter. For say. Jam. Jam. Say it again. Um, jam. Traffic jam. Traffic jam. Not twa a tra traffic. Da. Traffic jam. Okay. God damn. Say it again. God damn. One. Nah, I mean. God damn. Okay. Uh, the boss. Oh, it's rather our boss. Our boss. Okay, it should be our boss. Um, actually, you wouldn't say your boss. I mean, your boss wouldn't punish you for being late. Uh, you can simply ask, like, did he say anything about you being late? Did you say? Did he say anything about it? Did he say anything about it? Say it again. Say it again. Me or fool? fool? Did he say anything about it? Okay. Through. Say it again. Through. Uh, I think it's uh, not you, ma'am. Get through. through. Get F through. 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 Okay. Uh, so I'm going to give some comments in Vietnamese so that you will understand it better. But if I don't look at me, but Nam Hoang, but Nam, em, cái lúc phát âm bên nó giống như kiểu tiếng Anh nó gọi là eating the words, tức là em bị ăn cái từ nó nhiều quá. Giống như kiểu em cứ nghĩ 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 trong mồm ấy, mumbling, nó cứ, nó không nghe được nghe nó không rõ. <cười> Nếu như em muốn làm phân tích thì đầu tiên phát âm của em phải to rõ ràng đã, bởi vì người ta nghe người ta phải hiểu. Chưa. Cái anh, anh còn chưa nói đến giọng hay, thực ra bản thân giọng của anh nó cũng không hay. Thế nên là để mà anh góp ý cho em về giọng hay thì nó cũng hơi khó. Và thực ra là cũng không phải là không góp ý được bởi vì tai nó cũng chưa điếc. Nhưng mà đầu tiên phải nói cho nó rõ ràng đã. Các bạn Nói chuyện với người nước ngoài ấy, Các bạn nếu như mà không nói được nhanh Thì các bạn nói rõ ràng Từng chữ từng từ ra Được chưa Nghe thì có vẻ nó giống như kiểu là Một người đang tập nói Thế nhưng Người ta nghe người ta sẽ hiểu Khi bản thân mình Chưa nói được nhanh Thì hãy nói chậm và rõ ràng Được chưa Cái này em về em phải luyện lại Luyện như thế nào Nói hàng ngày, tập nói hàng ngày Cứ nói về các chủ đề khác nhau Tức là ngày xưa anh cũng thế thôi Anh đi học tiếng Anh thì Anh đi một mình ấy, những lúc đi một mình Anh cũng lẩm bẩm tiếng Anh suốt cả kể bây giờ Đừng nói đến ngày xưa, anh cứ tưởng tượng ra cái tình huống Sau đó thì anh lẩm bẩm anh nói Các bạn khác cũng thế thôi Chứ còn bây giờ không nói không Mà cứ lý nhí lý nhí thế không ai người ta nghe gì đâu Rồi về phần của Phú này Có những cái phát âm của em Nhìn chung phát âm của em thì ổn nhưng cái giọng của em nó vẫn rất là bé Ở cái giọng đấy thực ra thì nghe nói chuyện bình thường ấy 
mà nó không liên quan đến công việc mà phiên dịch thư ký các thứ thì nó không sao em nói chuyện nói thầm nói trao đổi bình thường thì nó ok nhưng để mà nói theo kiểu <cười> làm thư ký hoặc phiên dịch hoặc các chức vụ nào đấy mà cần đến ngôn ngữ thì nó chịu và một số cái âm của em nó phát âm nó không nó không đúng ấy. nó không đúng luôn ấy. chứ đừng có nói nó không rõ nên là cái gì mà mình không chắc mình trách kiểm tra lại và các bạn anh nói rất nhiều, nhiều lần rồi các bạn xem phim nhiều và xem clip nhiều và thấy người ta phát âm như nào bắt chước học theo cả cái anh bây giờ anh vẫn còn phải xem và anh vẫn còn phải sửa phát âm của anh cơ mà mặc dù là có thể là anh nói thì người nước ngoài người ta nghe người ta vẫn hiểu thôi bởi vì nó dựa vào ngữ cảnh tức là có 10 từ thì các bạn phát âm đúng 9 sai một thì ít ra người ta đoán được mẹ 10 từ phát âm sai chín đúng một thì bố họ chả đoán được đâu được chưa về nhà phải luyện thêm nhé ok we gonna uh, move to our topic today which is the airport so have you ever been to the airport before I, I mean been to the airport I don't I didn't say to fly okay, okay. Um, so who who has been to the airport before raise your hands please raise your hand please raise your hand if you has been if you have been to the airport before no so how can we talk about the airport if you have never been there oh my god did you watch any video like on youtube um i mean tomorrow we'll still talk about this so please at home you watch a video like how to travel by airplane in english or in vietnamese is is okay or what should we do in order to fly right in order to get on an airplane so um Hoàng Phạm, how far is it from your home, from your house to the airport? Mm, about 70 kilometers. Kilometers. Kilometer. Meters. Kilometers. Meter. Kilometers. Okay. So, how do you get there? Hmm by bus or by taxis taxis like plural you know plural plural, plural so you know single singular uh. singular so it plural so you know taxis yeah did, you did say taxis so I would just add, uh, like you don't take one taxi you take many taxis with you and like one for your luggage and one for yourself one for your girlfriend maybe or boyfriend for that matter I don't care and uh, okay that's good so why um, not how far is it from your house to the airport? Uh, um, I don't remember, but I think it's about um, 60 kilometers. Kilometers. Um, kilometers. You have to add the S at the end of kilometers because it's plural, okay? It's not singular. So anyway, um, yeah, I guess you will just take a taxi there if you have to go there, right? Yeah. Of so course. how much is it? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I I don't usually get a cup name, so I'm not sure. Wow. You 
I'm still medium. And you are still medium to me. So anyway, how much is it one kilometer, you know, by taxi? Ten thousand Vietnamese. Ten thousand Vietnamese down. Vietnamese down. Okay. okay. So, ten 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 thousand ten thousand ten sixty. How much is it? Uh, six uh, six hundred uh, thousand down. Thousand. Thousand down. Your town, right? Yes. Thousand. Thousand. Okay. Uh, do you think it is a fool? Do you think that is expensive? Um, I think it's not. It's not expensive. It's yes. cheap. Yes. It's the regular price. Yeah, it's the regular price. So, Tuan? Yeah. Do you live near the airport? Uh, my house is about five kilometers. Five kilometers? From the airport. Uh, so where exactly are you living? Uh, where are you living exactly? I'm living in uh, Kim Lu, Hà Nội. Kim Lu, South Sơn, Hà Nội. Okay. So, have you been to the airport before? <clears throat> Mm. I uh, hmm? I w went to the international airport. No, <laughs> international. International terminal. Terminal. It's not airport, but it's terminal. Ga ga quốc tế thì nó chỉ là terminal thôi. Airport means the whole airport. The international, right? Uh, yeah. yeah. International terminal. We have international terminal and what? Uh, to pick up the. How to say người thân? Relative. 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 To pick up my okay, to pick up one of my relatives. Say it again. Uh, to pick up on the one of my one of relatives. My relative. Uh, where did she or he go? Uh, she. Uh, I don't remember because it. A long time ago. How many? How long? Uh, ten years. Oh my God. Okay. Maybe. Okay. If it's ten years, then, then, then ten years, then, then, yeah, you may not remember anymore. So, there are two terminals, right? Yeah. The international and what? And national. National. No, 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 no. no it's not. It's domestic. Please write down, guys. Domestic. Hoàng Phạm, do you know the meaning of domestic terminal? Hoàng? No, I... I don't know. Can you guess? Like, we have international, meaning just like to go to foreign countries, right? Yeah. How about domestic? Domestic. Guess. Don't Google it. Just guess. Uh, 
Uh, you Google yeah. it, right? Yeah. I fucking told you not to do that. <laughs> yeah, domestic. Can you explain that domestic term? Like, uh, I don't know what domestic means. So, why now? Can you explain it to me? Help um, me to understand. I think it's mean uh, uh, we fly uh, um, uh, inside my country. Mm -hmm. My country? You know. yeah. you have to own Our it. country. <laughs> So, inside Vietnam, within Vietnam, or you, of course you would say it's na nation, national. National. Domestic means national, like within Vietnam. Or it can also mean local, right? Like say for example, you are a foreigner and you say that uh, I need to talk to local authority or I need to work i need i want to work at the local market right local market I mean you say the domestic market of the very country that you're visiting right okay um so yeah well you've been there right uh i i think um okay that is hard because you have never been to the airport before, so just guess along the way, okay? Uh, Nam Huang, what do we need in order to fly? Um, we need a um, ticket. We need a ticket, a plane ticket. A plane ticket. Uh -huh. Um, um, luggage. 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 Okay. Do we really, do we really need luggage? Um, no, it, uh, maybe yes, maybe no, if you have, like, if you have. Like, say for example, I don't have luggage. Can I fly? Of course, as long as you have, have uh, a ticket. Mm -hmm. As long as, say it again. As long as. No, as long as. As long as. Okay, that's good. Uh, what else do we need? Mm. Uh, a uh, passport. Um, passport. Okay. No, uh, uh, wait a minute. Okay. Say, for example, I'm taking a domestic flight. Do I need a passport? Um, no, you don't. You just need your uh, citizen license. No, it's an ID. We uh, call that an ID. Uh, Identification an ID. card. You know, identification card. ID. Identify. No, identification. It's not identify. It's here. Identification. Identification card. card. Okay. So, but I can I use my passport? Of course. Okay. You can use passport for domestic uh, terminal. Fly domestic fly, domestic fly. Okay. Um. So like, I'm just curious. Like, uh, you were saying that we need passport, we need identification card. Uh, what else do we need? I don't know. I think that's on. You need to fly. I never been and uh, fly before. Okay. So. Uh, cool. How early <coughs> should we arrive to the airport? Um, we should go there at least, I think, as late an hour. 
an hour in an hour advance before, or like before the flight yes why um i don't know for the best preparation what um uh, um just one sure just just to make sure just to make sure like okay an hour is it for domestic flight or for international international flight <clears throat> uh, for international flight no it's only for domestic flight if it's a uh, international flight you should be there at least 90 minutes earlier early or if it's like in japan right because they're you know the counter yes i know will close sometimes if you fly to japan it will close one hour before the flight then you have to go like three hours in advance or even four hours in advance really and just to make sure like you said say for example that day is very crowded there are a lot of people waiting right and you have to wait also it will take a lot of time really and you don't want to get late i, I mean you <laughs> You don't want to be late. Mà chúng ta không hiểu tại sao tôi cười đúng không? Ta nói nhầm thành cái từ get late. Hả? Late. Get late. Là đi nhau. You don't want to be late. <laughs> you don't want to be late. Okay. Of course you want to get laid. I know that. I sure know that. Okay, so anyway, uh, you know, like we have to wait in line to to check our luggage in, to check in our luggage. Wait to our turn. À, lúc nãy bạn Nam á, có nói là ơ uh, luggage là sai nha. Luggage không có đếm được. Nam nha. My brain is still very sharp. Còn mình vẫn là chưa chết được Ok uh, So anyway You have to check in your luggage If your luggage is too large Like Greater than Greater Than 7 kilograms Like There are two kinds of luggage Right Do you know that? Hoàng Hoàng Phạm yeah. How many kinds of luggage are there? And what are they? Mm. Uh, the Cầm tay luggage với cả cái gì? Cái một cái hành lý ký gửi How many kinds of luggage are there? Uh, it's it's two, I think. Two kinds. Like, what are those? Uh, well, uh, one side is one kind. You, one kind is you uh, can uh, like have. Keep, okay. keep, you can keep 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 it uh, in uh, the the airport. And uh, why, why would you keep it in the airport? On the airplane or in the airplane? Uh, on the air airplane, actually. I in. prefer it on the airplane. That is uh, hand carry, right? Hand carry luggage or 
You can yeah. just say hand carry, they would understand you already. And the other one is check in. Check in. Luggage. Right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Just like when you take a bus, right? Check. When you take a bus, if like you're carrying a backpack, then you can carry it with you to uh, on the bus, right? If you carry something very heavy, as every time you go, you go home and your parents send you a lot of produce, you know, produce, produce, I'm sorry, produce, like fruits, vegetables, things like that, because that produce, okay? You know what produce, produce mean? Yes, I what is know. It? It's not a verb, it's a noun. Now, yeah, it's not a verb. Yeah, yeah. What does it mean? Yeah. Uh, uh what what does the verb? What does yeah. pr produce mean? Sản phẩm nông nông sản. It's nông sản. Nông sản. So anyway, uh, if it's a lot of produce then you have to put it under the bus right I'm not really directly under the bus but the, the the lower cabin the storage area right and like we call that the check-in luggage um, I mean in uh, for an airplane it's the same they will just put it under their airplane like and um their compartment what is it what is the term for that what's something meant like compartment or compartment I, I think i don't remember exactly but this anyway the storage as area is below you it's not above but it's below okay so okay um yep we have to arrive early to check in our luggage if we have luck check in luggage and then <clears throat> you know like uh uh what <laughs> what items or what belongings are allowed to be brought to the uh, airplane uh, why now? What item should be brought to the airplane? Should be brought? I, I mean, what items can you bring to the airplane? Um, uh, uh, I think, I think it's, um, The things um, can you bring your fish there? Uh, can you yeah. guess? Just guess. I don't know how to say it. Um, <laughs> Your clothes, right? First, your clothes. A lot of items are allowed on the airplane, but okay, we're gonna talk about the items that are not allowed on an airplane. What do you think? Mm. Items that are not allowed. <laughs> you don't know? I don't know 100%. Uh, yeah, it's okay. I know that you're not so sure for 100%, but I'm here to help. So can you carry a bomb there? No. No. Can you carry a knife? No. What do we call that, those knife and bomb? We call that? Uh, weapon. Weapons. We, you cannot bring weapons 
to the airplane, right? Why? Why? Uh, because it's in danger. Dangerous. Aim, not man, but aim, aim. Dangerous. In danger. Dangerous for other uh, passengers, right? It's dangerous. Then in in dangerous for other uh, people. Mm, can you bring fish sauce there or durian mm. for that no. matter? Mm. Can you bring fish sauce there? No. No, why not? Of course. Mm -hmm. It's good, it's tasty. I'm a big fan of his sauce. <laughs> because of uh, its smell. Yeah. So, some. Uh, how about durian? Yeah. Uh, I think uh, its smell is the <laughs> too uh, hard. Too strong. Too strong. That's too strong. Um, durian, do you know what that is? You can say it in so Vietnamese. Okay. okay. So okay. Yeah, yeah. How about jackfruit? Jackfruit? Uh-huh. Meat? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes or no? Um, Yes, I think you can. No, if it's fresh, no. it depends actually. If it's fresh, then you cannot bring it to the airplane. If it's dried, and yeah, it's okay. Okay. Uh, Tuấn? Uh, how about alcohol? Do you think that we are allowed to bring alcohol, alcohol, alcohol to the airplane? No, I. Uh, every liquid is done. Liquid is not allowed. Uh, Why? Not, not. You said liquid. Liquid is not allowed. Is not uh, allowed. 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 is not allowed. 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 Uh, why? Uh, is it? I don't know, but is it? Um, you guess. You are an engineer, right? You're an engineer. I am not. I mean, I have a degree, but I never practiced it. So I wouldn't call myself an engineer. I'm listening. You don't know, okay? Well, you Nam Hoa, do you know why they don't allow us to bring liquid to the airport? I mean, to the airplane. Hmm, I don't know so. I don't know either. Not I don't know too. I don't know either. Okay. Uh, các bạn để ý lúc nãy mình nói là to the airport Xong mình nói là I mean the airplane Tức là ý là Khi mà bạn nói sai cái gì đó bạn chuyển À không ý là Ví dụ như Nói là uh, không mang sân, tới sân bay À nhầm Ý là Hoặc là à nhầm Hoặc là ý là Lên máy bay Thì các bạn nói là I mean I mean Oh I mean the airport So for example How about you fool What do you think Make up an answer Bia ra một câu trả lời nữa. Um, Make up bia. I think um, the liquid in the high at the high atmosphere can you know like it's um, 
grace what? Uh, at at the Weaker, weaker pressure. Uh, it can, you know, explore. Explode. Explode. Yes. Maybe. Explore means come far. Explode. Ex explode. Explode. It means uh, no boom. Or you can say it can go boom. <laughs> it can go boom. Uh, not boom boom though. Boom boom. You know boom boom. Boom 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 no, boom. Know. I want you in my room tonight and forever. You know boom boom. What boom boom means? Mm. Um. Oh, I don't. I don't. I have no idea. What? It means sex. Like when you go to Thailand. 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 When you go to Thailand, you would say boom boom. They will fuck you. Okay. Really? <laughs> I learned that. I learned that when I got to Thailand. They said, they, want, they said, you want boom boom? I said, what is boom boom? And they showed me a picture of a girl naked. Oh, I said, oh, no, no, boom boom. I'm bidet. Okay, so anyway. Uh, yeah, like you said, the uh, uh, bottle of liquid can my explode in the middle of the air in the middle of the air okay and that is not good or when it leak you know leak when it leaks i mean it can affect other customers or passengers right if it's it is uh, above your head right it leaks and it will fall directly to your head and to your body that is not good or maybe it can affect their electrical system of the airplane right yes it, it can happen so like you can bring anything under a hundred millimeter to the airplane to the yeah to the airplane okay okay some yeah. air some airlines allow that some don't mm -hmm. some don't even allow any liquid so to make sure you have to check it in you have to check it in you know Check it in. Giggle it. Okay. Uh, can can you bring anything sharp to the airplane? No. Sharp. Sharp. Suck no. No, you can't. Why? Like say for example, I I bring a scissors, a pair of scissors, but I just keep it within my bag. Like it cannot harm anyone. Um. Uh. Uh. Chỗ thì mình thì mình nguy hiểm hơn là thì sao? It might be dangerous. Say it again. It might be dangerous. It might, it might be dangerous. You might use it as a weapon. Yes. Right? Yes. Như kiểu thành phần nguy hiểm. Ai, tiếng Anh như gió, tiếng có, tiếng không. Tiếng Anh như gió, câu nói khó, thức bắn qua tiếng Việt. Chẳng qua là với anh thì anh hiểu tiếng Việt thì các bạn mới bắt nạt được thôi chứ còn ví dụ với giáo viên nước ngoài mà không bắt nạt được các bạn làm nào. Đấy thì giật ở đây. Ok. Yeah. You cannot, you cannot bring that to the airplane. What else? 
can you bring your child to the to the airplane like some months old only Rafa mm. some months old only not a year old but some months only I don't know. Can you guess? Come on, you're wasting my time. I don't know. You don't no. know. <laughs> okay, can you guess? Đít cũ cái thằng lồn này bảo can you guess đoán bừa đi thì cứ được đít mẹ mẹ đếm ai đôn lâu lâu cái cục cướt nếu bảo không nâu thì người ta bảo guess đi thì ngồi y thế đấy cười can you guess yes you can or no you cannot I can yeah because it's a human being you cannot be dangerous to other people come on <laughs> Although, of course, it will cry. It will certainly cry, right? You think it will <laughs> cry? I mean, even children, like three, four years old, or one, two, three years old, do you think they will cry? Yes. Why? They, they will cry. Why would they cry? And how to solve that problem? Mm. Uh, airplane sick. <laughs> plane sick. I don't know if we have this plane sick. <laughs> I'm not sure. I I'm not sure either. <laughs> How do we plane right? Yeah. Motion sickness. Motion, sick that. Motion, you know motion, air sick. Mm -hmm. I think okay. it's air sick and not. Yeah, yeah. I, I never heard of plane sick. <laughs> But air sick, yeah. Yeah, air sick. Air sick. Air sick, not plane sick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I never heard of. If a person in the plane who flies up. Air sick. Air sick. Yeah. Because of air sickness. Okay, maybe. Uh, Nam. Do you? Yeah. Uh, I mean, no. why Nam? I mean, do you think their baby will cry? Yeah. Why? Mm, maybe uh, <laughs> mm, uh, yeah, um, I don't know. Mm, like like what I said, uh, air sick. Because of air sickness. Because of uh, air sickness. Um, we call that air sick, uh, car sick, sometimes sea sick. Uh, but anyway, it's not. So you will be an engineer, and yet cannot eager, even figure it out. What the fuck? You should not. You should not get your degree. Really. You should return your degree to the university, and say no, I'm not qualified. Okay. One. Our engineer, our only engineer here, because he has his diploma. I mean, other than me. Why would the baby cry? Uh, I don't understand this question. Okay, the question here, when you bring a baby to the airplane, right? It will cry. Ah. Uh, Why? Mm. 
because Because of you, I never walked too far from the sidewalk. Because what? Okay, I'm gonna ask in Vietnamese and I'm gonna make you translate it later. Anh hỏi tiếng Việt trước, sau một lát nữa anh sẽ yêu câu các bạn dịch sau này. Tại sao khi mà em đưa trẻ con lên trên máy bay nó lại khóc? Và khóc tại thời điểm nào? Nó hay khóc. Toàn bọn chưa đi máy bay bao giờ nói về sân bay thì làm sao mà có cái gì để mà nói. Có thế. Như này nha. Các bạn đi thang máy bao giờ chưa? Đi thang máy lên tầng cao bao giờ chưa? Khi đi thang máy lên tầng rất cao thì các bạn gặp hiện tượng gì? Nó không khí. Ủ tai. Bị không? Phải cả loãng không khí mẹ đi thang máy. Áp, áp suất nó giảm. Áp suất giảm rồi người ta gọi là tranh lệch áp suất đúng không? Do tranh lệch áp suất thế nên nó sẽ bị ù tai. Đúng không? Hà Tuấn hay là anh nói sai anh không biết. Cái bằng của anh anh chưa sử dụng bao giờ. Phải không? Sợ. Mày có học bài không thế? Anh đang nói là khi mà đi lên cao một cách đột ngột đúng không? Thì bị tranh lệch áp ừ. suất nên là mình bị ù tai đúng không? Ừ, đúng rồi. Ừ. Chứ không phải là do đi nhanh đúng không? Ngày xưa có một ông anh học trường công nghiệp ra đi cùng một anh lên lo te cái tầng cao của nó đi ông ui đi nhanh ù hết cả tay. Chả thang máy nó phá ra nó cười toàn bọn nó cho học chính thuật ra. Ông bị bờ mà. Nó do tranh lệch áp suất thế bây giờ các bạn nói là đứa trẻ nó khóc bởi vì tranh lệch áp suất và tai nó bị đau nào dịch cái câu đấy đi đứa trẻ khóc bởi vì tranh lệch áp suất và tai nó bị đau chứ bây giờ ví dụ như là mẹ các bạn bán hàng thì hạn không may các bạn sử dụng bán một cái sản phẩm nó tương tự như thế bạn không tìm ra được nguyên nhân thì làm sao mà bạn khắc phục được hậu quả hậu quả mà còn làm sao mà xử lý được sự cố làm sao mà đưa ra các biện pháp khắc phục để mà khách hàng không có gặp sự cố đấy nữa hoặc là làm nào nếu như bắt buộc tức là bắt buộc phải trải qua cái đấy thì làm nào để để, để hạn chế nó chứ Rồi, toàn những cái kỹ sư kiến thức như cứ Rồi mời bạn uh, Phú nào đứa trẻ khóc vì tranh lệch áp suất tai nó bị đau the the baby cry because cries because uh, uh, air pressure difference okay pressure pressure difference difference and they have a ear hurt it's hurt and his ears hurt and his ears yes he is hurt. Hurt. hurt hurt yeah that's good thing like khác biệt nó là difference absurd là pressure pressure difference là chân là absurd được chưa? Ngoài ra ví dụ như là sau này các bạn đi các bạn sẽ gặp ấy, nó có một cái cụm từ này là high pressure pipe. Pipe là ống nước, high cao pressure là áp suất. Đường dịch là à, đường dịch là ống. Cái này dịch là gì hả 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 Tuấn? Cái này dịch là gì ạ? ba cái chữ là high pressure pipe kia sẽ lại ống chịu được áp suất lớn không phải là ống chịu sao không phải là ống chịu được cái gì Ừ. 
đường ống cao áp đường ống cao áp tức là nó đương nhiên là cái đường cái loại ống đấy nó phải chịu được áp suất lớn rồi và cái đường cái áp suất của nước trong cái đường ống nó lớn chưa? còn thực tế là bản thân cái ống nó có chịu được hay không thì tùy vào chất lượng của nó nhé nhưng bản chất là gì là cái nước áp suất nước ở trong cái đường ống ấy nó lớn chưa? giống như kiểu là em bị đụ ấy hiểu không thì nó to hay nhỏ thì em vẫn bị mà nhưng mà gì ạ cái bản chất của nó là đồ to chẳng hạn nhưng cái việc em có chịu được hay không đấy là một cái việc khác ok thế bây giờ quay lại về vấn đề là <cười> ok rich come back to our problem here the baby cries because the pressure difference and his ears hurt how can we solve this problem làm nào để xử lý cái vấn đề này nào khi bị ố tai thì chúng ta làm nào kiến thức trên trường đâu hết rồi Ooh. Uh, soon to be engineers wow come on come on guys give me some hope thì nhà ngày xưa tao ghét nhất là cái giáo viên cứ mỉa mỉa học sinh mm, kỹ sư ra trường thế này làm sao ra làm kỹ sư nhưng mà trên thực tế thì là đúng một phần mỉa thật kinh khủng nào Hoàng Phạm I think where the headphone or the the baby is the baby babe uh, earplug use a uh, use cotton uh, to uh, start earplug earplug yeah. earplug because the earplugs both of them right what else lấy cái bông bị tai nó lại gì nữa I can I don't know <laughs> I can let me see Nam Hoài Nam Hoàng Nam like like a uh, hoàng set there were what else yep so um oh you can um, bear with it <laughs> you bear it chịu bear, bear. Bear. bear you are good you will be a really good father in the future Like, baby, hey, Dad, um, it's, it, it hurts. Uh, my ears hurt. Oh, bear it. Saliva. 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 You can swallow your saliva. Swallow your saliva. No, no, no. Or you can give him or her something to drink or something to eat. Con trẻ con thì nhiều khi mình nó sẽ không biết là bụng nó nó bọt đâu. Mình sẽ phải cho nó đồ ăn hoặc đồ uống gì đó ít thôi. Tại sao nuốt nước bọt? lại đỡ bị ù tai. Ừ. À. thôi, ta chẳng dạy chúng mày kỹ thuật với lại các kiến thức liên quan đến tâm mệt lắm rồi. Được chưa? Cứ biết thế là được. được chưa? Bác sĩ bảo thế. Ok, anyway, we gonna stop our lesson today and please at home prepare a conversation related to airplane, airport, or whatever, okay? Tomorrow we're gonna talk about that. Bye-bye.